This video will demonstrate using Google Drive with the Bluetooth keyboard. Google Drive is the second app in my dock. I'm going to move to the dock using control right arrow. Dock, docks. Double tap to open. I'm going to move to drive using the right arrow one time. Drive. Double tap to open. I'm going to select drive using up and down arrow. Four. Drive, main menu, button. Toggle visibility of the menu providing access to settings and filters. I'm going to use the right arrow. My drive, grid view, button. I have mine in list view. If you would like to see what grid view is, select grid view. List view, button. Now the documents and the folders are in rows. I'm going to go back to list view. I am on list view at the top in my toolbar. I'm going to select up and down arrows. Grid view button. I'm going to use the right arrow to move down to my folders. I'm looking for iPad training. Add new item, search all, sort, folders, title, ADSS MTG notes, shared folder, modified make more actions, book and articles, folder, modified February 20. I use a control button to pause voiceover. I know iPad training is down farther on the next screen, so I'm going to use option right, uh, option down arrow to move quickly to the next screen. Page two of four. Now I'm going to go back up to more actions. It's a bit more actions. iPad training folder modified June 11th, 2015. But I'm going to select iPad training iPad training, back, button. Use the right arrow to move to Jupiter Inlet Lighthouse and select that document. iPad trip grid view, add new excerpt, sort, file, title, Jupiter Inlet Lighthouse 2.docx, Microsoft Word, modify June 11th, 2015, button. I'm going to select that using the up and down arrows. Docs, cloak, Jupiter Inlet Lighthouse 2.docx loaded. Now the document has been opened in Google Docs and it allows me to read and to edit the document. 